The Folger Shakespeare Library invited Lieve Watteu and her colleague Hendrik Hameu from the KU Leuven University in Louvain, Belgium to bring their tool, the Mini Dome. The Mini Dome is a device uh, which was developed at the University of Leuven since the early years 2000. The first steps why we used the Mini Dome was for registering cuneiform documents and it was uh, built to uh, capture any surface with uh, a topography. And the aim of their project is to tweak the device so that you can use it for early modern objects, such as books. The Folger Shakespeare Library is one of the best Renaissance collections in the United States. And we have um, thousands of books that um, could be studied with a tool like the Mini Dome. You just have to come down to the stacks and pull them. This is a binding that might be useful, um, that the dome might be useful to capture. It's an embroidered binding from around 1630s. So this is another embroidered binding from the soldier. The threads are starting to deteriorate and something like the dome would be able to allow us to monitor its condition. We will try this one, it will give a very nice result, okay. I hope. So we can monitor with the dome, taking 264 images in different angles, the topography or the structure of the book bindings. And we call it digital rubbings because they are more exact. You can measure the scale of the image, you can measure uh, the tools, the medallions, and it gives you a very exact uh, a tool to monitor or to document or to research uh, the objects. Uh, pictures are static images, so you can go for the best lighting system, uh, but it's, at the end you have a static result. With the Mini Dome we make 264 images, all with a different lighting angle. They're all being put into one and the same uh, virtual fi file, and that file can uh, light or relight uh, that object you have been registering uh, dynamically. It's so precise that you can actually see a three-dimensional picture of type, of ink, of um, varnish, of color. So the Mini Dome enables us to ask new questions. It prompts new questions, but it also helps us to answer uh, old questions. So we think that the, that the field of library materials has a great, great potential to do, to do this kind of art technical uh, research, research in help for uh, book histor historians. And it's a very active field. Um, and it's, it's just great to have a new tool on site like the Mini Dome because it does not happen that often that you get a new tool for material 500 years old. So um, you really have the combination of um, a field with very old books, four or five hundred years old, and then the cutting edge um, scientific tools to study them. And that's really exciting.